A group of Ohio lawmakers want to pass an abortion law that would be even more restrictive than the six-week ban in Texas, a move reproductive rights advocates say has already had a chilling effect among those in the state's right to choose community. Ohio House Bill 480 would make abortion at any stage of pregnancy illegal. It also includes some of the same elements as the six-week abortion ban, known as SB 8, that went into effect in Texas on September 1st, namely, that it would allow virtually anyone to file lawsuits against any person who knowingly engages in conduct that aids or abets the performance or inducement of an abortion for up to $10,000. Abortion up to 20 weeks in a pregnancy is still legal in Ohio. But state lawmakers have signed 30 reproductive health restrictions into law since 2011 and introduced even more, including Senate Bill 123, a trigger law that would immediately ban abortion in the state if Roe v. Wade is overturned. The U.S. Supreme Court will hear oral arguments on December 1 about a Mississippi abortion ban and potentially rule to overturn the 1973 landmark case that affirmed a constitutional right to abortion. Introducing HB 480 is also a political move to set the stage for the trigger ban, said Jordan Close Ohio State Coordinator for Unite for Reproductive and Gender Equity. If Ohio lawmakers can successfully pass the egregious HB 480, it will make the trigger ban appear not as extreme and more likely to pass, too, Close said. When Michelle Davis, a clinic escort at Your Choice Healthcare in Columbus, heard about HB 480, she told BuzzFeed News she was completely devastated. Davis has been a volunteer escort since 2015, shielding patients accessing abortion care and other medical services from throngs of anti-abortion protesters who gather outside the clinic with the goal of changing their minds. With HB 480 looming, reproductive justice advocates said the aggressive protesters Davis faces could also be legally empowered to act as paid bounty hunters no matter their connection to the patient, and take doctors, healthcare centers, and any other personnel in service of abortion to court it pisses me off that people who stand outside of our clinics and scare people, terrorize people, are working with the Ohio legislature to further criminalize pregnant people, Davis said. Thank you for watching. Please, subscribe.